So hi, Vicky Crystalin. Are you feeling the energy of this solar energy, these gamma rays that are hitting our bodies, our earth that is blasting us open? That's what's happening. Truly, that's what's happening. And um, I had to come out here and ground. I want to explain a little bit what's going on with my body. <clears throat> Look at I'm got all this mucus kind of clearing because our bodies are clearing there everything is surfacing you're going to be blasted open if you want to or not so that's this energy is here for it and yeah so it can either you'll struggle through it you'll suffer through it or you'll just ground into the energy and i mean being out in nature and yeah so nature really calms your system and it balances you so nature makes you where you're calm so um, go out and breathe deep if you're feeling a lot of stuff going on. What's crazy though, it started yesterday. Um, my phone, I can't send any pictures of my phone. I can text and receive calls, but I can't send any, no pictures will go through. And then some texts aren't, I'll text it and then I'll look back at it later and it says not sent. So it's already elect, uh, messing with our electronics. So then this morning I had to go to town and I go to town and the right side of my truck, because all the way around my truck, it beeps if there's anything around it. Um, so on the right side in the top corner, my truck started beeping and I'd never heard it before driving. So it was kind of freaking me out and it kept doing it. I was like, what the heck is going on? So my um, because it shows a beep and it shows lights, you know what I mean? When that beep starts happening, that there's something there, but I'm driving and there's not even a car around me. So I pull over to see if, you know, maybe something's on my bumper or whatever. There's nothing there. So I jump back in my truck and it's gone. It didn't, it didn't happen again until later I was driving around town and it kept doing it and it kept doing it. It was like freaking me out. I was like, okay, if spirits on my truck, you know what I mean? I send love, you know, we're good. And, um, so then finally, when I was driving home, that didn't happen again. Look at the energy so big. I need water, actually tea. And, um, so when I got home, I am um, the right side of my it's like my sciatic nerve because I I came home and immediately came out and started cleaning up my yard and being in my yard because the energy is so big I can feel it and it was so crazy because when I was in my house I got to clear my house I'm just getting that right now when I walked into my house my son's not in a good mood because he didn't sleep last night and um so I could feel this anger through my house. So I'm going to clear my house. I'm just getting that right now. So I came home and I, I started getting this pissed off feeling coming up inside of me. And until right now, I didn't realize where it's coming from. So I'm going to go inside and clear my house. And then, um, or as I'm sitting here right now, I'm asking for my house to be cleared. Ah. <sighs> I could feel it in my body. So, and then uh, the right side of my like sciatic nerve is like hurting, like big time hurting right after I got, got this feeling of being pissed off. So um, I'm out here grounding and then my arm starts hurting because I'm holding the phone up with my arm and my whole arm starts hurting. So I'm out here grounding and I'm just like, okay, I'm just going to breathe through it and whatever this needs to go through i allow it to go through gently and easy and for it to be cleared and restored to the light energy of love to my balanced self it's so funny because i feel like my guides are like right here so and i feel like they're guiding me through this because it's such big energy and so it is best if you guys are in nature, really self-care is big right now. So be in nature, drink water, be calm, listen to good music that's gonna make you feel uplifted. Um, just sit and breathe. Breath clears you instantly. Just breathe till you spill it, slip away. Take a breath with me right now. Breathe in through your nose, into your belly. 
I do it one more time. It feels so good. Breathe in through your nose. Ah, one more time. Three is always a great, great number. So one more time. Ah. Wow, this calmness came over me and I can feel the, what was going on on my right side just like slipping away. The pain was slipping away. So if, you're, if this is happening in your body, um, let the pain go. Don't get attached to what the pain is. Don't think about what the pain is. Just let it run through you because your cells are breaking apart. Your DNA is breaking apart to become new. So don't get in the trap of trying to hold on to try to figure out where this pain is. Just let it go. Just let it go. I mean, if you're in so much pain, you've got to go to the hospital. I get that. But um, really just go out. Even if you're feeling that, go out and ground first and just breathe because breath will clear your energy and it helps to stabilize this huge energy that's hitting our bodies so we got this we got this we truly got this oh let me tell you a funny story so i've been getting the hit um to get on a dating dating site and uh, i've been putting it off for months i've been having the thing for months you know getting a hit to go on a dating site so um i did yesterday i decided that i'm gonna go on a dating site well then i started seeing all these messages come up on my phone and i was like oh i don't want to look i don't want to go there i don't want to even look and um so i was talking to my daughter and she's like mom just just look so I ended up looking last night and you know what it just I gotta trust the process and the process I feel is for my person's gonna walk into my life however that's gonna be so today I was gonna take myself off the dating app and uh, I don't know I'll just let it be yeah I'll just let it be and if I am to shut it down within 24 hours because I just started it last night um, so be it but I'm proud of me. That's a big step for me. So, not that, you know, I don't get out, ask out, but I haven't met that person, my person. I haven't met my person yet. Yet I feel him coming in big time. So, as we're going through the rocky road, there is a light of the tunnel, and it's like I'm feeling this other side of that. My uh, person coming into my life. Yeah. How freaking exciting. Ice and love, we got this.